Richard Dunn on his Iron Curtain in Russia display that is hailed 11 years on. Richard Dunn played in 684 professional fixtures during his extended playing career that lasted from 1996 until 2015, but there is not a shadow of a doubt in his mind over which one was his best ever performance. Back in September of 2011, the Republic of Ireland stalwart lined up alongside Darren O'Dea in front of an inspired Shea given in a Euro 2012 qualification clash against Russia and Moscow and had to put in the performance of a lifetime to take home even a point with the visitors failing to create a single chance. Dunn pulled off a ridiculous goal line clearance after half, an hour and numerous blocks and tackles followed in what Paul McGrath described as the, the best performance ever from an Irish central defender including his own against Italy at the 1994 World Cup. He tweeted at the time, Richard Dunn congratulations. The best performance I have seen from any Irish centre half and that includes myself. The point went on to be an important one with Ireland going on to secure a place at Euro 2012 with a 5-1 aggregate playoff win over Estonia. Speaking to Daily Star Sport in his role as a BT365 ambassador 11 years later, Dunn says, that was the best match I played in my career. Who put in the best individual performance you can remember? Give us your thoughts in the comments section. It was one of those nights where everything seemed to hit me and you can't replicate it. Some games just happen and you are more involved. Luckily we got a draw. The reaction after was really nice and I really enjoyed it, people still talk about it today. But it could have been Darren O'D who was playing beside me, it could have all been coming down his side, you just don't know. At club level, the imposing defender made 431 appearances in Premier League across spells with Everton, Manchester City, Aston Villa and QPR, at the same time racking up 80 appearances for his country. Dunn called time on his career following two seasons in West London from 2013 to 2015, later moving with his wife and two children to Monte Carlo, where they reside to this day.